chasing the police every single day. Sheets files motion to request judge's recusal in probation case. By Frank DeFury staff writer 16 hours ago. Punta Gorda Andrew Sheets has accused the judge in his probation case of unfair treatment. Sheets, 57, and his attorney Kevin Shirley filed a motion on September 14 to disqualify Judge Peter Bell from his case. He is absolutely biased, Sheets told the Daily Sun on Thursday. Sheets was convicted by a jury in June on charges of breaching the peace and disrupting an educational institution. Bell withheld adjudication in the case, on the condition Sheets complete 12 months of probation and 100 hours of community service. He was also forbidden from contacting Sally Jones Elementary School, as well as possessing firearms while on probation. Sheets was arrested by Charlotte County deputies shortly after the sentencing, Authorities said he violated probation by posting a video encouraging others to protest outside the school on his behalf. New terms for probation were set after Sheets had spent some time in jail, including a new bond of $5,000 total and an explicit stipulation to avoid using third parties to contact Sally Jones School. The motion to disqualify Bell rests on terms the judge set for probation. The court set a bond but did not allow the defendant to post the bond for 30 days from the date of arrest, essentially sentencing the defendant to near maximum penalty for the offense without due process, the motion read. The motion also claims that Bell, a county judge, lacks the standing to preside over writs of habeas corpus. This claim cites Article V of the Florida State Constitution, which stipulates that the Florida Supreme Court explicitly has jurisdiction to issue writs returnable to justices, Court of Appeals judges, or circuit judges. Meanwhile, the motion alleges, the state constitution does not explicitly outline the county court's jurisdiction. The actual text of the section dealing with county court reads, the county courts shall exercise the jurisdiction prescribed by general law. Such jurisdiction shall be uniform throughout the state. The Florida Supreme Court's website states that county judges are eligible for assignment to circuit court, and they are frequently assigned as such within the judicial circuit that embraces their counties. Charlotte County is part of the 20th Judicial Circuit, and Bell is listed as a county judge on the website for the circuit. Sheets also stated in the motion that he filed a complaint with the Judicial Qualifications Commission in August and that he is in fear of retaliation from Bell for filing the complaint. The motion is scheduled to appear before Bell on Friday, the next court appearance for Sheets, he is also in the process of appealing his original conviction. Sheets is also currently engaged in a civil lawsuit against Punta Gorda regarding code enforcement fines. He and another man were fined for displaying signs that read F. Biden to protest the city's ordinance against obscene language signs in public spaces. Oral arguments closed in the civil case before Judge Jeffrey Gentile on August 4. Gentile has not issued a ruling in the case as of Thursday.